We have no snow for this evening's rush hour. I think we'll get away with both rush hours tomorrow. It's tomorrow night. If you're going to be out late tomorrow night uh, toward uh, 10, 11 o'clock midnight, that's when the snow could start to be a problem. What's a problem with the weather watchers today? They usually tell us where uh, things are looking good and where things are not so hot. It's not so hot literally around uh, the West Loop. Patrice said she had 26 degrees now and uh, snow fell earlier today before that sky started to brighten. I don't know whether you had snow where you live, but there were some reports of, of snow being around in uh, northwest Indiana. There's 25 degrees from Raymond. I think Raymond had some. Yeah, he had a trace of light snow on the ground from the morning snow showers. And then we had some other folks who were south of the city that had the same thing occur. Maybe a little snow in LaSalle. I'll see what Chris is saying 24 degrees feels like 15 light snow on the car this morning uh, flurries possible at uh, worst they'll be in northwest Indiana and they won't create a problem tonight uh, tomorrow night a different uh, story 29 was the official high today 19 was the start this is way too cold for this time of year it should be in the mid 30s should be near 40 for a high for this part of December uh, what's the story generally tonight breezy cold tonight I don't think we'll see any snow uh, within the next, um, you know, eight to 10 hours or so, 20 degrees for Flossmoor overnight tonight, 15 at Wheaton, 15 degrees for Gray's Lake overnight tonight. So no problem uh, this evening. It's uh, keeping track of that snow from a clipper that's coming this year. We're always talking about those clippers that come from way up north and move down toward Chicago. This is uh, late in the day tomorrow, about 10, 1030 or so, overspreading the area. We'll start first up around Barrington and Elgin and up around Crystal Lake and then move down toward the city in Indiana overnight tomorrow night into Saturday morning. The steadiest snow will fall. It should be gone for most of us by 7, 730 in the morning. But notice still falling over in, in parts of Indiana and Michigan through the day on Saturday. That's why there's more concern about snow totals there. One to three inches of snow, the two to three being closer to the lakefront. You live out toward DeKalb and LaSalle, parts of Will County. You may not get that much snow at all. And then we're looking at the snow that could fall, continuing to fall around Porter, Valparaiso. You could have four or five inches of snow by Saturday evening. So anybody's got to drive around the lake and up toward Berrien uh, on Saturday afternoon. Those could be some trouble spots. We're keeping an eye way up north. It hasn't even entered the country yet, but it'll be dropping down from Canada. And the only alert that we have in effect actually starts tomorrow night and then runs through the day on Saturday. Saturday. That is for LaPorte County, where LaPorte and Berrien both have that winter storm watch in effect until 11 o'clock on Saturday night. But in the meantime, bundle up 18 and we'll call the average overnight low tonight. And then as we roll them out, uh, we got episodes of snow is what I'll call them. The first being tomorrow night, the second being on Monday. Here comes another wave on Tuesday, uh, clouds on Wednesday. I don't want to go any further than Thursday. <laughs> the way this is Please looking. Please don't. Now, these aren't big snowstorms, <laughs> but they're little rounds of snow. Maybe they'll get you in the holiday spirit ah, if that's what it takes. That is a nice way to look Just at it. Keep us honest here. Just tell <laughs> us when the snow's coming. <laughs> that's We're good. Right. Thanks. Thank you, okay. Steve.